I work diligently, you know, all the time, and I'm motivated each and every day. It makes, gives an opportunity for those areas to do more business with Georgia. We have many investors in Georgia, and I know that Liberia is open for business as well as all of Africa. The satisfaction of seeing the growth of a student over the time they're with you and even though it's in some respects sad for a student when they, they, they go away and leave your group, we know that that's in fact the process. They have to learn, grow, and then go off and be their own independent scientist. So seeing your students flourish to me is really the biggest reward for doing this kind of work. We report on um, events that uh, affect Atlanta as an international center. If we're in Liberia, we're going to be looking for institutions, individuals that relate to Atlanta. Well, the main goal within the organization is to eliminate social and economic disparity um, uh, for the disabled in Liberia, West Africa, if possible in the whole world. to educate our children to have better health care and to, to, to make sure we prepare our children for the future. And you can't just say go out and do it on your own. You've got to start giving them experiences while they're still students. The education, uh, the educational institutions are just critical to creating these relationships. It's such a great way to be able to cross cultures. I saw it as uh, an opportunity to be able to give back. I guess the main thing that I want to do is to, to do a good job. You're trying to do something that's never been done before, but more importantly, they learn how to solve problems. You can be anything you want to be. Uh, the sky's the limit. Stay in school and um, be very resourceful and um, give back to our community because we can do it. I've been doing this a long time and I know how fulfilling it can be. I founded this organization and decided to give back since and since that time we've uh, distributed over 5,000 units of assistive devices throughout the country you know equating you know equating to about a million dollars you know, United States dollars and um, ever since um, I've been motivated to do this with a passion. And so these kinds of resources are becoming more and more available. Chemistry is going to be central to building the GDP of the country and the development of our next generation of chemists in Baba and Saki, I see as a major contribution to uh, Liberia that myself and Clarkland University are able to make. Um, millions of people um, all around the world support us and they, they love what we do and, and that encourages me a lot to continue to, to do what I'm doing. Well, I am totally honored to have this award. Um, and while I have not been to Liberia, its richness of humanity, its resources, um, its contributions are going to be um, extraordinarily important in the world's development. I just want to say I'm just so honored that uh, Liberia or, and all the other states have, have recognized that I'm here for them and with them. They don't have to give me any awards, but when they do, it makes me feel that I'm appreciated. I just say thank you, thank you, thank you. And for those who thank me, I say you're welcome.